Hey guys, today I kind of want to do a little bit of an explainer video talking about some of the process that goes into the reviews themselves. I think it's one of the coolest things about my reviews here on the channel. If you guys are new here to the channel, I've done over 60 plus VPN reviews, more than anyone else on YouTube and pretty much anyone else anywhere. My VPNs are rated by how good they are, not how much they pay me because there's no sponsorships included within my channel. But the thing I want to talk to about you guys today is my application analysis, which I think is really cool. And we're going to be filling this out for more VPNs this year. Basically, the way the application analysis works is it's like a feature breakdown of every VPN provider. Now, I only have around six VPNs in here or so for this year, but I've done this for other VPNs last year. I just didn't compile it all together just because I didn't really think to do it. Um, it was just kind of in the videos. But this year, we're going to be compiling it all together. And the application analysis really is pretty cool because it shows you a lot of things about VPNs that other reviewers don't really mention. Stuff like Linux GUI support, if it has an like extension for the website, if it works for Firestick, how many Android application trackers it has, permissions, website trackers, as well as all the features and stuff you would ever need from a VPN provider. So this application analysis is available on the comparison table. And you can find that, of course, by you know going to the tier list and clicking at the top like I showed you already. But I think this is pretty cool, guys. It also shows stuff like if it includes a BitTorrent proxy. And it lets you easily compare VPNs in terms of feature sets to see exactly what you want. And like I said already, not every VPN is in here. And eventually, it is the goal to put everyone in here. Um, but you know, some VPNs already have it in their own videos, just aren't filled out here yet. This are this these are pretty much the re reviews I've done this year so far in 2021. So we've made a pretty good start already. You know, just within a couple of weeks, we already got seven or so on here. Um, so yeah. I don't know if I'm going to be putting like every single VPN in here this year um, because there is a certain amount of repetition with VPN reviews. Some VPN reviews don't have that much changes going from a review to review, so it's not always necessary to make a brand new video, especially if some of the VPNs aren't popular. But I will try to put all the popular and talked about VPNs in this analysis. Um, we see some really good differences here already. You know, you have something like private internet access VPN, almost getting a perfect score here in the application section. Probably one of the best applications out there. Is it the top VPN? Well, not necessarily. And then you have other VPNs like Bitdefender VPN, which is just a copy and paste rebranded version of a Hotspot Shield. Um, it's just the same exact kind of service, but completely bare bones. You have other things like Tunnel Bear, which is just so simple. Stuff like Surfshark, which is making good headway and getting some more stuff added. And I'll put NordVPN there soon. And ExpressVPN does have some, you know, limitations here and there, but it is pretty simple. So guys, keep a lookout for the application analysis. Just a little bit of an update, you know, on some of the process behind the scenes. We have so many VPNs here added to the list. I think actually I said 65, but I think we're actually at 66 VPNs reviewed now as of 2021 in the beginning. So stick around. Uh, this year should be pretty interesting. I've been making a lot of updates to the chart here and there. Of course, you could find all that on that transparency report. If you click on that here, it takes you to the transparency report. We can see all the different um, updates I've been making just in the last month alone. There's a lot of updates. So make sure to check that out, guys, as well. And I'll see you again in the next video very soon.